I've been in this league uh, 14 years, and um, you know, from from the beginning, you know, two years in, I felt like that um, I wanted to, uh, you know, put my guys in position of power and give those guys an opportunity to better themselves. And um, you know, in the beginning, we were um, highly criticized, and I was highly criticized about what I wanted to do to help some guys around me become uh, very successful in business. And um, you know, it just sucks that uh, you know that you know now at this point, um, having one of the you know biggest businesses that you can have, both on and off the floor, having a, a certified agent in Rich Paul, having a certified business partner in Maverick Carter, um, that's done so many great business um, that the the title for young African Americans is, is a, the word posse. You know, so it's um, you know. It, you know, for me, we see the success that we had, but then there, then it is always someone that uh, lets you know how still, how far we still have to go as African Americans. You know, and uh, I just don't believe that Phil Jackson would have used that same term if um, he was doing business with someone else. Um, you know, and and uh, you know, working with another team, or if he was uh, working with anybody in sports that was owning the team that wasn't African American and they had a group of guys around him that he didn't agree with what they did. I don't think he would have called him a posse. Um, you know, but it just shows how far we still have to go. And, uh, you know, but it won't stop us uh, from doing what we need to do as a group. Um, I've put together a great team. I've empowered some guys, um, you know, since I was a kid and we've all grown together and become one of the, you know, people that try to model after. So we're not going to let uh, Bill Jackson's comments um, stop us from doing what we need to do. Uh, it just gives us extra motivation. And, um, you know, it's just still sad, though, to see that, you know, people at the top always want to try to put guys in power down. Do you have any, so, do you have any relationship with Phil? Zero. No relationship at all. Uh, I had nothing but respect for him as a coach for what he was able to do, obviously, at the helm of one of the of my favorite player of all time, MJ, and also been there growing up and watching with the Lakers, but uh, I got nothing for him. Hoop jab. Hoop jab.